Hey, let's live in universe. It's Xander, and welcome back to WWE 2K22 Universe Mode. Welcome back to AEW Dynamite. Big episode here tonight. We got the tag team championships on the line as the very first matchup of the night. Here comes Jurassic Express to the ring. You got Luchasaurus on the left, Jungle Boy on the right of your screen. These two guys beat the guns a couple of weeks ago to become number one contenders to the tag team championships. So, the Jurassic Express make their way to the ring. Here come the tag team champions, though the new tag team champions, their first defense since defeating FTR for the gold twice in a century. Miro and Scorpio Sky making their way to the ring. So Miro and Scorpio Sky twice in a century. The unlikely duo that became tag team champions just a few weeks ago. Miro and Sky making their way to the ring. Big defense for these two tonight to kick us off on Dynamite. So the AEW Tag Team Championships up for grabs. Jurassic Express. Versus twice in a century. Let's do this. It's going to be Jungle Boy and Scorpio Sky starting us off tonight. Here we go. Scorpio Sky starts it off with a drop kick, knocking back Jungle Boy. Launches him across the ring towards the corner. Knee into the back, knocks him towards Miro. And then back to his feet now. There's a roundhouse kick. Circling him now is Scorpio Sky. It's kicked by Jungle Boy again now, and Jungle Boy takes him down. Grabs all of him now, and Jungle Boy into a neck breaker. Scorpio Sky goes down, and there's a tag made to Luchasaurus. And the dinosaur is in. He scoops up Scorpio Sky and Luchasaurus. Tombstone Pile Driver takes him down. Grabs a hold of him now, and Luchasaurus. Drags him towards the center of the ring. Into a cover now on Scorpio Sky for the one. No, Scorpio kicks out. Scorpio Sky fighting back to his feet now. There's a right hook. Knee to the ribs from Scorpio Sky. And Scorpio Sky dodges him. Snapmare takes him down. Gets the ropes and a drop kick to the side of the head taking down Luchasaurus. Scorpio Sky now getting him back up to his feet. Grabs hold of Luchasaurus. Launches him into the corner. Him right towards Miro there, and no Luchasaurus fighting back though. Ducks him, rolls through, and Luchasaurus now swings through with an, a Hurricane Rana taking down, Lu, taking down Scorpio Sky. Goes for right hook, and Sky counters. And now Scorpio Sky sends him right back towards the corner. There's a right hook. He'll do a kick now, and Scorpio Sky caught with another right hook from Luchasaurus. Counter for counter here, Scorpio Sky. Knee into the neck, into a neck breaker. Tag is made, Miro is in. And now Miro down in the ground and pound, punching Luchasaurus in the face. Stomps him in the chest. Miro getting him back up to his feet now, and the Redeemer with a roundhouse kick, and Miro, knee strike. Grabs onto him, sending Luchasaurus off the ropes. Miro pops him up with another knee strike into a roundhouse again. Getting him back up to his feet now, Miro. Super kick. Now Miro gets him back up again. Went for another one countered. Luchasaurus grabs hold of him now, and Luchasaurus grabs Miro and launches him across the ring. Luchasaurus now gonna get Miro back up to his feet. Scoops him up, and Luchasaurus presses him overhead and into a moonsault to Miro. Cover for the one, two, kick out from the Redeemer. Miro kicks out. Tag is made to Jungle Boy. And now Jungle Boy Jack Perry is in. Goes for the moonsault. Lucha, or Miro out of the way. 
Munchka kick! Connects to Jungle Boy. And Miro getting Jungle Boy back to his feet. Another Machka kick! And Miro, oh, well, went for the kick. Looked like he was going for game over. Sunset flip from Jungle Boy. One, no, kick out from, from Miro. Miro gets the shoulders up. Jungle Boy grabs hold of him, and Jungle Boy right hook connects to Miro, taking him down. Tag is made back to Luchasaurus. Luchasaurus gets into the ring now, and Luchasaurus telling Miro to get back up to his feet. Miro in trouble. Luchasaurus went for a boot. Miro, the two big men of either side going at it now. Oh, Miro gets him with a shot to the gut. Miro now sending him off the ropes, and Miro pops him up in the strike. Roundhouse kick. Turns him over with a kick now, and Miro with game over. Game over is in. And game over could seal it. Scorpio Sky. Scorpio Sky. Oh, grabs Jungle Boy. And Scorpio Sky. TKO to Jungle Boy. Which opens Miro up to grab Luchasaurus up on his shoulders. Alabama slam. Right back in. Game over. Game over's back in. It's over. Twice in a century retain. Twice in a century retain in their first offense of the gold. A big win there for Sky and Miro, proving they're not just a flash in, a pan, in the pan, proving why twice in a century are your AEW World Tag Team Champions. That is a big win there for Scorpio Sky and Miro. Game over seals the deal. That TKO to Jungle Boy really set it up in the end. Twice in a century keep their gold tonight. But you gotta wonder when the former AEW Tag Team Champions are gonna show their faces again. When they're gonna come back to Dynamite. And when they're gonna challenge twice in a century to that rematch. Because you know it's coming any day now. Big win for twice in a century. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to hear from the AEW El Capitan, Chris Jericho, up next about next week's Iron Man match and a little bit more. AEW, this is your captain speaking. I just wanted to take a moment to confirm that John Moxley and Buddy Matthews are not in the building tonight due to their Iron Man match next week. We needed to make sure that we kept them as far away from one another as possible. But, I want to confirm that next week is going to be a huge double feature show because not only do we have that big Iron Man matchup between John Moxley and Buddy Matthews, but we will also... Be seeing a TBS championship matchup between Dr. Britt Baker, DMD, and Tony Storm. So without any further ado, well, ladies and gents, your TBS champion. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Jericho throws to her. Here comes the TBS champion. Here comes Tony Storm. Tony Storm's got her work cut out for her next week. Does the current TBS champion and former SmackDown Women's Champion. She takes on the first ever AEW Women's World Champion, Dr. Britt Baker, next week for that TBS title. Tony Storm makes her way to the ring. Here comes Anna J. Anna J making her way to the ring, the Queen Slayer. One of the breakout stars of the year for AEW last season. Now tonight she's got an opportunity to go one-on-one -on -one with the TBS champion. Big matchup for her tonight for sure.
So Anna J makes her way to the ring. So, any further ado, here we go. Anna J starts off with a right hook, goes for a slap. Tony Storm with a right hook of her own. And now the TBS champion lighting her up with shots. Storm comes off the ropes, gets caught. Anna J, neckbreaker, takes her down. Now Anna J grabs onto her. Tony Storm pops up. Jawbreaker. Tony Storm with a big headbutt knocks her down. Storm getting Anna J back up to her feet now is Tony Storm. She's firing away with right hooks into chops, kicks her in the ribs, spinning wheel kick connects. Storm now lunges her across the ring into the corner. Tony Storm knocks her down. Storm getting her back up to her feet now. And Tony Storm blows line into another. And now the TBS champion comes off the ropes. Another clothesline connects. And now she's got a hold of Anna J for another headbutt. Getting her back up to her feet. There's a right hook again, knocking her back. Anna J grabs onto the TBS champion, though, and Anna J throws her off the ropes over the top rope. Out to the floor goes Tony Storm. Tony Storm is down. Anna J standing over. Tony Storm staggering back to her feet now, and Storm. Slides back into the ring. There's a chop and another one. Tony Storm knocking her back. Elbow strike connects. Tony Storm off the ropes. Big boot to Anna J connects. Getting her back up to her feet now. And Tony Storm with another chop. Anna J staggers back now. And Tony Storm, oh, sidestepped her. Punches her in the back. Oh, went for a shot. Tony Storm got caught with an elbow. Big running kick from Anna J. Anna J knocking her down now. And the Queen Slayer going up the top rope. Climbs the rope. Scales it. Here we go. Oh, went for a diving stomp. Tony Storm out of the way. Tony Storm rolls it through. Cover. Bridges it. For the win. One. Two. Kick out from Anna J. And now Tony Storm kicks her in the ribs. Goes for a cutter. It looked like Anna J caught her. Anna J floats over. Tony Storm turns the neck breaker around on her. And now Tony Storm. Standing over, what's Tony Storm thinking here? Storm. Stalking her, she gets back up to her feet, pulls her in. Tony Storm. Oh, pile driver. Storm drops her with a pile driver. And now Tony Storm with Storm. Zero. For the one, two, three. Tony Storm gets the win off Storm Zero. A quick victory there. Tony Storm with the win over Anna J. Tony Storm showing what she's worth tonight. Showing just what the TBS champion is made of. Big win there for Tony Storm. We got plenty more, but ladies and gentlemen, we hear from the Gun Club, Austin and Colton, up next. You know, first, our deadbeat dad wants nothing to do with us, and now, now our best friend in the world, MJF, wants nothing to do with us. Well, what's the pride to do, man? What's the pride to do? Well, we'll tell you what. Me, Austin, Morrissey, the three of us, we're still loyal to the pride. And I'll tell you what, we found someone. Yeah, we found someone real good, real good. And this guy, he's gonna... He's going to lead the pride. He's going to show you all what for. He's going to show you all to doubt us. And don't worry, you'll meet him soon. Oh, you'll meet him real soon. And then soon, you'll all be sorry you ever doubted us. We're heading into some more singles action. Up next, ladies and gentlemen, here comes Sammy Guevara to the ring. And when you see his opponent, you will understand why this episode of Dynamite is very short. That, and I'm on a time crunch, because it is the week of Christmas, and I have so much to do to where Universe was my last priority this week. Apologize, but you know, I'm a normal guy with a normal life. Sometimes making this YouTube show is 
not what I need to be doing. Drink. So, yeah. Sorry about that. We'll get back to normal. Next week's got at least. Next week's got a title match and a 30 minute Iron Man match. You'll live with one shorter week at Dynamite. Not every week's going to be a freaking pay per view link show. You should know that by now. So, Sammy Guevara has made his way to the ring. He's going one on one with the guy who won last week's Battle Royal. Wardlow. Wardlow scored every elimination in the eight-man battle royal last week. Wardlow beat everyone. He eliminated everyone. And last, but certainly not least, he eliminated MJF. Uh, now tonight, Mr. Mayhem marches into this matchup with Sammy Guevara. So, without any further ado, it is Wardlow versus Sammy Guevara. Here we go. Oh, there's a boot from Wardlow out of the gate. Wardlow pulls him in. And oh boy, here we go. The symphony begins. Sammy takes a power bomb. And now Wardlow grabs onto him, kicks him in the ribs, pulls him in, and Wardlow. With another. Getting Guevara back up to his feet now. Wardlow pulls him in again. A third power bomb. Wardlow just staying on top of it at the moment. Wardlow not letting up on Sammy. Gets him up, but oh, wait a minute. Sammy Guevara fights out of the power bomb. Wardlow shoves him back though. And Wardlow! Oh, went for the kick. Sammy! Got him on the crossbody into a cover. Not even one. Wardlow got the shoulders up. Now Sammy Guevara gets Wardlow back up to his feet. Goes for a round. Goes for a kick. Wardlow shoves Sammy Guevara away into the ropes. Now in Wardlow sends him into the ropes. Ducks him. Wardlow hits the ropes for a clothesline. Now Wardlow gets him back up to his feet. Snapmare pulls him in knee to the face of Sammy Guevara. And now Wardlow pulls Guevara in, kicks him in the ribs. Wardlow gets Guevara up again. Wardlow, power bomb! And Wardlow kicks him in the ribs again. Wardlow, more time here, has him up for another power bomb. And Wardlow, looking then it just as quickly as it started, scoops him up, throws him on his shoulders, for the F-10. Cover. One, two, three, no! How the hell did Sammy Guevara kick out? Wardlow stomps his head. Drops the elbow on him as well. And Wardlow taking him down, Guevara back to his feet. Guevara with a hurricane run into Wardlow. Now Sammy Guevara picks him up, and Sammy Guevara, ripcord knee strike, takes down Wardlow. Sammy Guevara getting him back up to his feet now, and Sammy grabs onto Wardlow. Sammy Guevara, no! Wardlow drops him. And Wardlow getting Guevara back up to his feet. Sammy Guevara in trouble. Wardlow launches him into the corner. Clothesline. No, Guevara caught him, but Wardlow countered. Wardlow with a boot. Now Wardlow. Gets Sammy back up again. Wardlow pulls him in and Wardlow power bomb. And Wardlow now one more time. A second F10. Cover. Oh, Wardlow got off of him. Wardlow. Has Guevara up for one more power bomb. One, two, three. A big win there for Wardlow. Absolutely destroying Sammy Guevara tonight. Wardlow's done that just about everyone he stepped in the ring with as of late. A big win for Wardlow. 
Be careful, Keith Lee, because this is going to be a very different man from the one you faced at Full Gear last year. Whoa, 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 I'm going to stop you right there, Bearcat. You know, get a lot of nerve putting Warpig in that matchup last week, because we all know that I'm better than you. You know it. I'm better than each and every person here. I'm the first ever AEW World Champion. And I think we all know that if you hadn't put War Dog in that matchup last week, we all know I'd be the one challenging you, and we all know it would go exactly like Grand Slam did last year when I ruined your little homecoming, your little debut party for AEW by beating you in the middle of the ring. And we all know that I'd beat you for that TNT title the same way I beat you to keep my AEW World title. Maxwell, it's good to see that you have not changed a bit since last year. I'll tell you what. Anytime, any place, anywhere. If you're so confident that you can do it without nine men backing you up, then I look forward to our next encounter. But until then, I would like to get my eyes onto something much more pleasant, which is quite honestly anything else other than you. Hey, you can't just insult me and walk away. That's not how this works. So ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the main event. Here comes the murder hawk monster. Here comes Lance Archer. Lance Archer making his way to the ring. The Murder Hawk Monster set for action here in our main event tonight. So Lance Archer storming down to the ring. He's got a big opportunity ahead of him tonight. He's going to go one-on-one -on -one with the current number one contender to the AEW World Championship. The leader of the kingdom. He's going to go one-on-one -on -one with Adam Cole. Lance Archer making his way to the ring. Here he comes, folks. Here comes Adam Cole to the ring. Adam Cole set for some singles action. You see Mike Bennett and Matt Taven accompany him to the ring. The undisputed elite fell apart. Adam Cole and Kyle O'Reilly seemingly having split their paths. And now Adam Cole has had to call in one last chance at backup. Adam Cole making his way down to the ring. This is going to be a big matchup for him tonight. Lance Archer is a big test for any man in AEW. The size of Lance Archer, he's one of the few big guys in AEW. So Adam Cole making his way to the ring. You know what it's time for? With the drop of the boom, Adam Cole steps into the ring. It's main event time. Archer and Cole one-on-one. -on -one. Speed versus power. Here we go. Archer with a jab to the gut. Adam Cole punches him now, knocking him back. Cole! When Zakari knocked him back into another. Knocking Archer back again. Archer. Look out. Cole coming off the ropes. Cole hits the ropes. Archer out of the way. Archer went for a springboard forearm. Adam Cole with a drop kick to the back. Cole seemingly kind of stalled him there. And a running drop kick. Oh, that one didn't drop him either. For another one, falls flat on his back, though. And now Archer grabs onto Cole. Lance Archer's got him up on his shoulders. And Lance Archer throws Adam Cole into the air and knocks him down. Archer bends back the arm. Stops the arm of Adam Cole. Stops him again. There's another kick now. And Lance Archer grabs the arm, bends it back, and stomps on it again. Cole rolls back to his feet. And Adam Cole. Lance Archer back. And Zagari, that one floored him. And now Adam Cole's managed to take the murder hawk off his feet. Going for stomps again. Lance Archer grabs onto him now. And Archer pulls him in. Scoops him up. And Archer with the... 
Hanging. Suplex to Adam Cole. Cole goes down. Lance Archer getting him back up to his feet. Sets him with a right hook. And now, oh, went for a splash. Adam Cole got out of the way. Adam Cole kicks him in the ribs. Adam Cole firing away on a, on Lance Archer. Adam Cole now. Close line. Into another. And now Cole ducks him. Super kick. And Cole kicking him down now. Here comes Lance Archer, though. Archer grabs onto him. Lance Archer sends him into the corner in the Murderhawk Monster. Grabs onto Adam Cole again. Elbow to the side of the head. And again, Adam Cole goes down. Lance Archer now standing over him. Cole is down. Lance Archer thumbs up, thumbs down. Archer hits the ropes. Splashes Adam Cole. And now Lance Archer bends back the arm and stomps on it again. Lance Archer getting Adam Cole back up to his feet. Archer throws him into the ropes. Adam Cole being manhandled right now as Lance Archer punches him in the face. Into another cover now. Adam Cole's down. Lance Archer for the one. No. Archer's got him down though. And now Archer grabs onto Adam Cole, scoops him up, and Archer... Running power slam. Get this for another kick. Archer gets caught. Cole sweeps the legs. Lance Archer with a right hook now. And Archer goes for a springboard. Adam Cole out of the way. Adam Cole turns him around. And Adam Cole kicks him in the knee. Hits the ropes. Cole with the boom. Knocks down Lance Archer. And Cole hits the boom. Grabs onto Archer. Sends him in the corner. Kicks him in the head. And Adam Cole with a boot to the face. Grabs onto Archer. Stands him up. Archer caught him. Archer. Oh no, Adam Cole. You see the look on his face. Of, oh God, blackout. Archer with blackout to Adam Cole. And now Lance Archer dragging him towards the center of the ring. Archer into a cover on Adam Cole for the one, two, Kick out from Adam Cole. Archer's got him down now, and Archer getting Adam Cole back up to his feet goes for a kick. Adam Cole says, Oh, no, you don't. But Archer now scoops Adam Cole up. Adam Cole. DDT in the center of the ring. Adam Cole now getting Lance Archer back up to his feet, kicks him in the knee. Cole to the back of the head now. The boom connects one more time. Cover on Archer. One, two, no. And that just shows you the power of Lance Archer. The murder hog monster back to his feet. Sweeps the leg of Adam Cole and splashes on him. Lance Archer takes him down now and Archer with Cole. Stomps the arm. Goes for another splash. Adam Cole out of the way. There's a right hook, Adam Cole knocking him back. Adam Cole, spinning wheel kick, knocks back Lance Archer. They collide there, and now Lance Archer grabs onto him, and Adam Cole in some serious trouble here. Lance Archer launches him across the ring. Into a cover now, Archer. Cover on Cole for the one, two, kick out from Adam Cole. There's a kick now, Lance Archer grabs onto him. He picks Adam Cole up, and Lance Archer Big punch to the face takes him down. Lance Archer now. Oh God, went for a springboard cannonball. Landed harsh on the back there thanks to Adam Cole moving. And now Adam Cole firing away on him. Adam Cole knocks him into the ropes and Cole with Archer off the ropes. Went for an elbow strike out. Archer. Code breaker. Adam Cole nails the code breaker. Throws. Throws Lance Archer into the corner. Archer finds the counter. Cole with a right hook, though. And Adam Cole knocks him into the corner again. Adam Cole grabs Lance Archer, and Adam Cole kicks him in the knee. Here we go. Panama. Sunrise. One, two, three. Adam Cole with Panama Sunrise gets the win. 
What a win for Adam Cole there tonight, folks. Manages to put down the Murderhawk monster. Manages to put down Lance Archer. And now Lance Archer, back of the line, Adam Cole, further proving why he is the number one contender. A big win there for Adam Cole, baby. Oh, hang on a minute. Ladies and gentlemen, there's the AEW World Champion. You know, Adam, the Bucks and I plucked you back from obscurity. We made you a lead again. We helped you win championship gold that you'd never had. And how did you repay us? You stabbed us in the back. Oh, Kenny. You know what the difference between us is? I've been champion everywhere I've gone. You can't say the same thing, though, can you? You know... I left on my own terms at the at the playhouse. You never even made it out of developmental. And I think you're scared because you've seen both of my world championship reigns and you know that yours will never live up to it. And you know good and well that I'm the best there is in LS11 Universe. Because I'm Adam Cole. What the hell? Kyle O'Reilly? Kyle O'Reilly's back. And O'Reilly. Dumps Omega and O'Reilly in the face of Adam Cole. That's all the time we've got tonight, folks. Until next time, I've been Xander and that was Universe.